In this video, I will show you how you insert SIM card slash SD card if you have the Moto G Power 2023. And this is Variety Stick 2. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't. Give me a thumbs up. And without any further ado, let's find out. First, we need a SIM ejector tool, something look like this. Normally, you find it in the box if you purchase the phone brand new. Or if you don't have, use needle, pin, anything will fit the hole or has the same size of this SIM ejector tool. Also, you're going to have a SIM card. Either you have like an older SIM card from an older phone and you want to insert it on the new phone. SD card is optional if you want to add extra storage to your device. Now first we need to find the SIM tray on the phone, normally on the Moto G Power 2023 located on the left side and you're going to see a hole next to it. So this is where we need to put the SIM ejector tool and we need to make sure it click and the SIM ejector tool it should pop like this. Now let me take a closer look to the SIM tray here because the SIM tray explains so many things. First of all, you're gonna see how you should insert the SD card and the SIM card. Now this place where the SIM card goes and this place where the SD card goes. Now when you put the SIM card, you have to make sure the numbers of the SIM card has to be face up where it says face up and also there is a curve from the corner has to match the curve on the SIM tray just like this. Now when it's nice and flat like this, you know now the SIM card inserted on the right way on the SIM tray. Now you do the same thing with the SD card. You grab the SD card. You should be able to see also picture how you should insert the SD card. And we're going to have face up where is the number, how many gigabytes the memory card also has to be face up just like this. So you do the same thing with the SD card. You make sure nice and flat just like this. and trying to be gentle as much as possible and grab your device go to the same place where you took the SIM tray and insert and has to go smooth the SIM card and the SD card inside and push it all the way in so normally the phone will read the SIM card by itself now if it doesn't restart the phone and make sure you're inserting active SIM card memory card I would highly recommend if you're removing the SIM tray and you have already a memory card to turn the phone off before you do this I hope this tutorial was helpful for you to put the SIM card and the SD card to your Moto phone. If it did, you can give me a thumbs up, encourage me, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching. As always, we will talk to you in the next video.